ready on a starter's orders to get underway. The final race, 15 kilometers mass start. Here we go, the best 30 in the world in terms of their ranking over the season plus this week. So no one has been left out of this one. It's Samuel Sanu leads at the moment for Sweden. Just listen to the crowds. This is what racing is all about. I tell you what, the Alpine races would be jealous of this, these numbers, this noise, this much enthusiasm. Field Maye, very quick, working left to right. Three out of three so far. Number four goes wide to give Samuelson an opportunity. Latyapov, guess what? Five out of five. Ligrid, the world champion, hits five. Logging off goes clear. Tadja Burt is clear. Well, I think we expected this the last time around by Jacqueline deciding to, having been four seconds behind as he left the range, he's completely destroyed, caught up the four seconds and now completely broken away from the rest of those chasing. I think the crowd is starting to feel it might be his day. Are they going to get their second winner in a weekend? Possibly. Well, he knows exactly what he's doing. <laughs> well, he's gained another seven, third, yeah. seven seconds to this point. That is incredible. I mean, we very rarely see such pace by one athlete uh, breaking the rest of the field by such margins. So Jacqueline, he's having a, a very inspired day. The Pursuit World Champion looking to win a mass start at home. There's your first mistake. Well, not, that's not bad. Not bad that at all. That is not bad. 3.3 to play with. He certainly can't afford a penalty loop this time should the chasers uh, hit targets. There's Phil Maye. He has matched uh, Johannes Tingisburg pretty much shot for shot so far today. Johannes looks to be tiring a little. Phil Maye has closed the gap to 17. 14 out of 15 so far. Can he get his third ever World Cup win in front of home fans? Has to get five. This is what Jacqueline did yesterday. <laughs> Phil Maye did yesterday. Fantastic. That is the answer. Absolutely sensational. Leitner, he's shooting for a podium place. He needs five. He's got five. Phil Maye goes clear. The chase is on, and Jacqueline is far from safe, having used up so much energy earlier on. And the Norwegians, represented by Christiansen and Bo, we've got five leading the stadium within 15 seconds of each other. So, for the second day in succession, the French get a long, long ski into the finish with the <laughs> national flag, the trickler never flown more proudly than here in Le Grand Bonnard. Absolutely brilliant two days of biathlon. And the French, who struggled to win here for so long, finally show us how it is done. Jacqueline, the Pursuit World Champion, takes the win here in the Mass Start goal.